All right, everybody. So today we're going to take a look at and unbox this brand new Casa Smart slash TP Link Wi Fi enabled power strip. So this is essentially a smart power strip that you can monitor and control straight off your smartphone. So there's different buttons that you can use as well, uh, but essentially you can control each one of these via your smartphone with the app, the Casa Smart app, and it can integrate with your other Casa Smart products. So if y'all have seen in my previous videos, I have this Casa Smart smart plug, and I've, I was using it with a power strip, which probably wasn't the best, uh, but I was charging some of my Ego batteries, and it seems like this can't uphold the amount of electricity, so that's why I wanted to get one of these, that way um, it's not overloading or what have you. Uh, especially with three battery charging docking stations. So without further ado, let's go ahead and try to open this up. I should have brought my little tool. A little knife. There we go. Let's take a look. There we go. All right, so again, we have our little instruction slip. Essentially, you're just going to download the CASA app. I hope I'm saying that right. You're going to plug it in, you're going to pair it, and then you should be good to go. There's also some help if you need it. But take this plastic off so it does have three 5 volt uh, 2.4 amp I'm guessing USB slots no USB C but honestly I'm not gonna need this for for you know charging a phone or anything like that this is gonna be strictly in my garage gonna plug in three ego power stations and I'm gonna see how it goes I'll be able to turn them on and off straight off my phone that's what I'm needing this for, and uh, let's go ahead and plug this in and uh, see how it works. All right, everybody, so I have the CASA power strip, surge protector, whatever you want to call it, uh, hooked up. It's, it's really a smart power strip, but it's all hooked up. You see the lights are on. I have my Ego battery charging stations plugged in, one, two, three. Then I have one more product at the bottom but I wanna show you guys what the app looks like here. So this is the CASA app. And so there you go, you can see the on and off. So I turn that one on. So the light is on now. We're gonna do number two, or excuse me, three. There's two. And so all lights are on. All the charging stations are, are good to go. Yes, this is dirty. I mow a lot, as y'all know. So well, these batteries are fully charged, but the point of this is I can individually control these right off the app. So I don't have to comb out here, turn this on and off manually. So pretty cool. I'm going to end up plugging in some of the other power stations I have and other equipment battery charging equipment um, I was using like a regular search protector but it was cheap and you know I don't want to risk anything with with these heavy duty especially this this is a 100 watt fast charger uh, and that's a 12 amp battery so I didn't want to mess up anything I didn't want to blow a fuse or anything like that so this uh, essentially covers that and again I can mon monitor everything I can turn these on and off straight off the app so there's other, six other, or excuse me, three other plugs, as you can tell from here. So they're all on now. And then I can also just turn them all off straight off the app, but the big key here is being able to do it, you know, one at a time, because this one's going to charge faster than these. Um, so, yeah. But yeah, let me know if you have a power strip like this. Let me know if you're using something similar or if you do have this one how you've liked it so far 
as of right now, the last couple of days I've used it and it's definitely made things way easier. Again, I was using like a smart plug to hook up over there and the smart plug was plugged into a search protector and it kept like messing up going out. So that was just a software update from the Castle smart plug, but it's probably because I just had so much stuff plugged in and charging at the same time that it just kind of gave out. So this is definitely a must have if you're doing kind of the same setup as me and uh, let me know what you think. Uh, other than that, until next time.